Now it's time to see how the girls handled this situation. Check it out. We set up to run the scenario again, this time with teen girls. Our new female bully and victim actors were in place and the cameras were rolling. Our producers conducted a few minutes of a group interview and then, as before, excused themselves from the room so we could see what happened when the girls thought the cameras were off. There's some snacks and stuff here. We'll be right back. Our actors started the scene and our bully started giving our victim a hard time. So you said that you liked video games? Yeah. What girl, you know, plays video games? You don't really dress like you'd be a girl. You kind of dress more like a tomboy. Do you guys have iPhones? Yeah. What phone do you have? Mm, a Windows. A Windows phone? Yeah. Those aren't very cool. At first, the other girls in the room didn't seem to pay much attention. But as the insults escalated, they stepped in and challenged the bully. She knows how to dress. It's just that, like, we have a different set, set of style. I wouldn't classify that as a style. Do you judge people by the way they look? No. Well, oh, you're doing that right now. I was just letting her know. I'm just saying, just let me shut up before I say something. Yeah. Are you OK? She's fine. She can speak for herself. And as things continued, the other teens began to comfort and befriend our victim. What is it? Are you okay? I'm oh, for real. Okay. You want some? No, okay. It's gonna be gone. <laughs> <laughs> We brought in a second group of girls to run the scene again. Are there any favorite movies right now? No. I gotta change it out. Stop down? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, make yourselves at home. There's snacks, How long do you think drinks over there. Oh, I'm like shaking. I know, I was too. This time, the other girls in the room found humor in some of our bully's first remarks. I love your hair, the braids. Yeah, are cool. it's really good. Do you ever braid your hair? Or do things like that? I just leave it like it is. I mean, it doesn't look good like that. But then quickly, one of the girls has a strong reaction. Do you like to dress like a tomboy, or do you dress like... Wait, are you, like, trying to bully her? No, I'm not trying to bully her. Yes, you are. I was just pointing something Please out. Please don't do that. Give me an example. Tell me. Well, you told her that her hair is ugly and that she looks I mean, like a boy. She kind of does, though. I was just being... She's fine. As the scene continues, the teen girls take a strong stance and shut our bully down. Don't you do didn't that. have to say that, But it's though. really yeah. rude. I feel like everyone's entitled to their own opinion. Though. Yeah, but not everybody wants to hear your opinion. So sometimes you should probably keep your opinion to yourself. <clears throat> well, it's quiet here. <laughs> it wasn't five minutes ago. <laughs> Lisa, you, you reacted pretty strongly. How come? I just know that she really needed this person who could stick up for her because, I mean, I know how it feels. Have you ever been bullied? Yeah, in middle school. I was bullied because of my English. Because so of my English? accent, yeah. So you were the object of bullying, you were the target one time, but you notice she used two different strategies when she stood up to the bush. She wasn't just supporting the girl that was the target. She said, will you please stop? She was very, it brought tears to my eyes. I mean, to be that nice to somebody that's being bullied, and you did, then you became firm. I mean, that is an ideal way to approach this, which yeah. is, look, hey, please stop, and then gave her some insight, and then stop it. And I, I, I know I'm crying a little bit when I think about this. It yeah. was very emotional. It's yeah. Crazy. Be able to mobilize that kind of resource. Absolutely. Absolutely. And Danielle, were you surprised that your uh, daughter Divine stepped in? Yes, very much so. I mean, every parent wants to think that their child is perfect, but with my Divine, you know, some days you get that perfect child, and other days you get that Divine. <laughs> but when I was when I was offered the opportunity, I said, "Well, this would be a good experience." I didn't know if she would go along with the bullies or intervene, and I'm very proud. I'm, you're doing a good, good job. Yeah. Hey, folks, welcome. Uh, thanks for checking out my YouTube channel. Don't forget to click here to subscribe to my channel. That way, you won't miss a single hot new video, some really good stuff. And then I want you to click here to see more clips from the show right now.